Hello everyone, it's Joel with Anansi Creative, and today we're going to create a download button inside of Webflow that directly downloads something stored in Google Drive. Now before we get started, I want to point out this is a feature of Google Drive and not Webflow. So there are many other ways you could use this technique. This is just the one we're going to go over today. Inside of Webflow, you'll notice that there's no way to do this natively. And so this is a way without any code, without spending very much time on it, that we can build custom download buttons and store files of any type in a secure place. This is just a really awesome method to use. Let's start the tutorial here inside of Google Drive. What you'll want to do is right click on your file, get a shareable link. We'll copy this and drop it in here. It's not quite that easy. We've got a, another couple steps. Let's go to sharing settings and set this to anyone on the web can view this. That way they're not going to get blocked by you need to sign in to Google in order to download the file. It'll just directly download to their computer. So we'll save this and then we need to get rid of some of this link. So we'll go to the after ID equals portion of the link, get rid of everything before it. And then you can follow the link in the description to my GitHub page where you'll find this. Copy that and drop it in before. And that is it. The link is configured. So let's publish this. Go to the live page and see if this works. Hit download. You can see it downloaded. Open that up. And that is the file. So in conclusion, this is a super easy way to put download buttons into your Webflow project or any other project that you want to. I hope you got some value from this video. If you did, help us grow the channel, and I will see you guys next time.